A chilly day in New York City, and that's where we find News Channel 25 Sports Director John Elizondo. He's traveling with the Baylor men's basketball team. Uh, John, the Bears hope to heat up tomorrow night. Yeah, it may be a little bit cold out here in New York City, but the lady, or, but the Bears were lighting it up today inside at Madison Square Garden during practice. You can check out Jonathan Motley hit a half-court shot. That's on my Twitter. You can go check that out a little bit later after this sportscast. But as for the Bears today, well, they are approaching this game like any other game this season, looking for respect. That is the big thing today, despite being the highest-seeded team remaining in the East region. The Bears are only a four-point favorite tomorrow night. Many skeptics say the Bears' easy road to the Sweet 16 casts a shadow of doubt over this team. But when talking to the players, they embrace the scrutiny as they face similar doubts earlier this season and route to a 15-0 record and a number one ranking in January. Yeah, definitely a little more motivation for sure, uh, you know, being, you know, the underdog or whatever. But, I mean, we just go out there and handle our business, do everything we can every day to make sure we can get ourselves to that point, you know. We don't really care about, you know, what seed we were or who we played. We just want to go out there, just execute what we do and uh, try to get the win as best way we can. Coming up at 10, we'll take, uh, we'll break down the biggest challenge for the Bears as they face South Carolina. And also later in the newscast, we'll have, a reliable, we'll have a report for you from Oklahoma City for the Baylor Lady Bears as they get ready for their Sweet, seat, sweet 16 matchup as well. Reporting live in New York City, John Elizondo, News Channel 25 Sports. He looks a little chilly there in New yeah. York.